Welcome to the Code Show. Today, you're going to get to watch me cook a marshmallow over the stove. And here we go, with the marshmallow over the stove. The first step is to turn on the stove. Make sure it lights so you don't just spew gas into your house. The next step is to get a giant marshmallow. Oh, a kitty wants to go out. What a sweet kitty. Oh, she's a sweetum. Aren't you a sweetum, Sulu? I'm going to take you out in a bit. I have to finish this unit test thing first. Um, okay. The first step is to get a giant marshmallow out of the fridge, which I already did, and put it on a fork. The next step... No. <laughs> the next step is to cook the marshmallow. Meow, meow. Be sure to turn it so all sides get warm. And try not to let any side get burnt. Oh no! Oh, no. Sometimes, sometimes you need to turn down the stove a little bit because it's too hot and it cooks the marshmallow too fast. Too fast. Oh my. Got a friggin' Maybe I need to hold it higher so it doesn't burn. Burned marshmallows taste great on the outside, but they're inconsistent in texture on the inside. If we cook them more slowly, they'll be more even. You can also use the microwave, but that's cheating. The next step is to look at the cute kitty on the floor. Meow. Oh no. Yeah, maybe this is done enough, I don't know. Oh yeah, it's soft and falling off the fork. So now we're gonna turn the stove off. And now we get to eat it. Ah. Mm-hmm.